Sound of Freedom is a hit, it outperforms Taylor Swift's The Era's tour in the 2023 box office standings. Among an unexpected change of events, the thriller Sound of Freedom has defeated Taylor Swift's The Era's tour film at the domestic box office, claiming a slot among the top 10 grossing films of 2023. The independent film, produced by Angel Studios, grossed a whopping $184,177,725 by the end of the year, narrowly beating out Swift's concert film, which came in 11th place with $179,635,196. Sound of Freedom, based on the true story of Tim Ballard, a federal agent on a mission to rescue a young girl from sex slavery in South America, became a sleeper hit of the summer. The film, starring Jim Caviezel, opened on July 4 and earned $19 million during its debut weekend. The success of the movie is even more notable considering its modest budget compared to other blockbuster productions. The movie was the summer's underdog. Producer Eduardo Verastegui, emphasizing the film's significance, revealed that he dedicated eight years of his life to its creation. The movie deals with the harrowing issue of human trafficking and marks a departure from Verastegui's involvement in the popular faith-based television series The Chosen. Despite facing media backlash and accusations of promoting QAnon conspiracy theories, Sound of Freedom resonated with audiences, receiving a 99% audience score on Rotten Tomatoes. Critics, on the other hand, gave it a 57% rating. Sound of Freedom outperformed other 10 T poll films. The success of the film makes it the highest grossing indie picture since 2019's Parasite. It outperformed big budget films such as Indiana Jones and the Dial of Destiny and Mission Impossible Dead Reckoning Part 1. Domestically in 2023, the top three highest-grossing films were Barbie with $636 million, the Super Mario Bros. movie with $575 million, and Spider-Man, Across the Spider-Verse with $381 million. Sound of Freedom took 10th place, demonstrating the tenacity of independent cinema and its capacity to have a great impact on spectators.